Hi, I understand from some of you that you are having a problem with the homework assignment which is currently week three on accuracy and tolerance uh, and calculating those values. So I thought I'd do this quick little lecture on some of the terms and some just some examples of how to do uh, some of these problems. I'm going to be using a technology that um, I'm just learning also, so uh, you can bear with me a little bit. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's look at the two terms of range and span. Now, question number one of the assignment for week three had a, an error in the text, and I sent you an announcement about that with a fix to that. But let's take a look at the difference between range and span. First of all, range is specified using two, net, two values. And span is specified using one value. So your span should never be more than one value your range is always going to be two values. So let's take a look at a number line. I'm going to put a number line here. And some of you, sorry, I'm not drawing a very straight line. Some of you may have not seen a number line since elementary school. But let's put some values on here. We'll put a, we'll, we'll put a value here of minus 60. And we'll say this is degrees. And we'll put a value up here of, let's say, a say 120 degrees. So I've got a range of minus 60 to 120. So in this case, my range, again, two values, is minus 60 degrees to 120 degrees. Now the span is the difference between the min and the max. So my span is going to be equal to the 120 degrees minus the minus 60 degrees. A minus and a minus is always a plus, so my span is actually going to be 180. Notice I got one value. So the range is minus 60 to 120. The span is the space in between them, which is 180. So let's think about a similar problem that I, that I gave you on your assignment. I gave you, let me, let's do this. I have a, a line here, and let's say I have that minus 60 degrees to 120 degrees. And let's say that that is my thermometer. So the, my thermometer can re measure between 160 degrees and 120 degrees. So my thermometer range is equal to minus 60 to 120. And the span of my thermometer is 180. My process, let's say my process though is running from minus 10 degrees to 90 degrees. So this is my process and this is my measuring instrument. The range of my process is then going to be minus 10 degrees to 90 degrees. And the span of my process is going to be the 90 minus the minus 10 
which is equal to 100. So the span is 100 degrees. I hope that makes sense because um, it's a very simple concept. Okay, and I'll see you in the next video.